Hello, this is Greg from Nitty Boy. On today's Behind the Song, I want to talk about I'm a Pop Star. That was the first song released on the album Synth Pops back in the year 2000s. And it was, I believe it was actually the first song I wrote for that album. The uh, idea of that album was, you know, because it followed Stating the Obvious, which was a pretty dark and serious album, we wanted to make Synth Pops more of a fun album. In fact, you know, the album cover looked like a cereal box. The CD itself looked like a bowl of cereal. When you took the CD out of the case, the picture behind it looked like an empty bowl of cereal with just a couple little pieces of cereal left. It was really cool. And uh, anyway, um, I decided to remake this song, or reimagine it, if you will, for, for the new album, Reimagined. And I uh, want to give it a little bit of an updated sound and uh, just make it sound a little more modern. Anyway, the lyrics to the song, um, while you know, not exactly uplifting, they are fun, but they are definitely sarcastic. And uh, the idea of the song, you know, we have our pop stars, we, you know, we, we look at our pop stars and we think they have everything they could ever want, they must be happy, um, things are going their way, everything's peachy with them, right? But this song is actually from the opposite perspective from the perspective of the star themselves where you know they they want to they want to come off as being happy but you know somewhere deep inside there they know they're missing something and uh i'm not saying that all stars are this way but this song is from the perspective of one that is um you know it starts off the lyrics are you know driving a nice car they have everything they could ever want nice house all the latest and greatest sounds um but and then you know it talks about how you know they have all these people that are their best friends at least as long as there's money around to spend on them um, and then the chorus is kind of a sarcastic look at themselves look at me i'm a pop star i'm a radio star and i'm so popular and but then the second verse kind of takes a turn and uh, apparently this pop star grew up in a house um you know in a christian home learned about God, their mom told them about God, but they don't want anything to do with God anymore, at least until they're riding in a hearse. Because while they're here having fun, they don't want to have to think about things that are more important, like God, until they're dead. Then that's important to them. And, you know, that talks about how they have, you know, all the money they could ever want that should last them for a while. Um, you know, they try to buy up things to make themselves happy. But then one day, all their cash is gone and they lose all their friends. So I guess it's time that they better write a new song. So it can all start over again. And that's what this song is about. Um, like I said, it's a short, simple song, but it makes a good, valid point. The lyrics are down below in the description if you want to read them. And uh, I'll see you tomorrow for tomorrow's Behind the Song. Thank you. Cause I'm a pop star. Stop!